Welcome back. A local artist went from doodling during his day job to painting some of Madison's most recognized murals. Our Andrew Banster tells the story of Triangular Door. You've probably seen this mural driving down East Johnson Street or others like it from the same artist. But the real masterpiece is the story behind the artist. Leobov Swaco moved to Madison from his native Mexico City 12 years ago. He didn't start drawing for another seven years. The first thing that I drew was a triangle, therefore the name Triangulador, which means triangle maker in Spanish. He started doodling at his service industry job when customers weren't around. Five years ago, though, he picked up a different canvas, mattresses left on the side of the road. So the mattress was a perfect opportunity for me, like, oh, I get to do whatever I want. If it's cool, it's going to the garbage. If it's trash, it's going to the garbage. Suddenly, he realized he'd found his passion, and by practicing on mattresses, he became a better artist. A lot of the murals, ideas, or a lot of techniques, or a lot of the patterns that come from other stuff have come from me practicing on the mattress. When COVID hit, he was still just drawing on the side, but when his day job closed and his immigration status meant he couldn't get a stimulus check, suddenly he needed art. They kind of more than allow me, kind of like forced me. People were stuck inside their homes and they wanted to redecorate, which sparked his career. I was just painting and a lot of people were wanting me to sell the paintings and I think people had uh, extra, extra money sitting around and they couldn't go anywhere to spend it. The world is his canvas. During the George Floyd protests, he turned boarded up windows into art. So it was beautiful because a lot of these artists were not given opportunity before that. It was their first time to, to paint on something. So I think because of this, uh, the whole movement, it created a whole new generation of artists. He never dreamt of painting full time. He certainly didn't dream of being recognized or having murals all over town. His art is changing communities. To him, street art allows Madison to belong to the people. You learn how Art is not just something to look at, but how people interact with it and how like it can be uplifting for our community. He emphasized to me that if you pursue your passions, the world can be your canvas. In, I'm Andrew Banstra with News 3 Now. Triangulador told News 3 that in the coming months, one of his mattresses will be in one of Madison's art museums, part of a street art series. To see his full catalog of work, just head to this story on channel3000.com.